moms and dads, grandmas and grandpas, sisters and brothers, aunts, uncles, cousins, young, old, male, female, you have a part, right? Everyone has a role in the family. Everybody can step up and do something for someone else. We've talked about uh, men and women, but also children, right? Children have a role in the family. One of their roles, obviously, is to obey their parents, but they also take care of their siblings. They also take care of their cousins. They teach them. They guide them. Everybody has a role. And so I want to ask you today, what is your role? What's your role in the family? Are you the comforter? Are you the protector? Are you the caregiver? Are you the provider? Are you the one that takes care of everything? Are you the one that knows people and you'll stay on that phone and call people until you get the job done? Are you the loyal one, the faithful one, the one that forgives, that gives mercy, that sticks by someone no matter how badly they mess up? Are you the confident one, the strong one, the courageous one? Or are you the quiet one that listens and lends an ear to other people? Are you insightful, thoughtful, able to see things that maybe everyone else in the family can't see? Are you helpful, encouraging, hopeful, gentle, caring? Are you decisive, detail-oriented, analytical? We need people like that, right? Are you the one that never gives up? The one that keeps going? Maybe you're just the funny one, the entertaining one, the one that helps everyone enjoy life, right? Everyone has a role. And some of them are contradictory. Maybe you're the peacemaker, or maybe you're the one that says, no, I'm standing up for justice. Maybe you're the one that takes charge. Or maybe you're the one that's good at following directions, listening to instruction. Maybe you're the supportive one that tries to never say anything negative. Or you're the one that says the thing that needs to be said, right? Maybe you're the stable one, the generous one, the hospitable one, the one that takes in all the strays, the one that's flexible and can adjust and help everyone else to adjust when everything is changing. We need everyone. And so what I'm telling you today is look at these three people and how they used what they could use in their time, in their station in life, and, and they helped people and do the same. Whoever you are at your core, be that for the people that you love. Be the person that they need whoever that is. And then that might change. As you get older and your situation changes, that might change. And so you have to be ready for that and say, you know, that used to not be my role in the family, but now it is, and I'm willing to step up. These are the things that we can learn from Ruth, Naomi, and Boaz. And so think about the things that we've talked about today and see how you can fulfill your role in the family, in the community, and step up where you're needed.